When the Super Nintendo hit shelves in 1990, it marked a new era of gaming and everyone was clamoring for Mario's biggest adventure yet. After all, Nintendo had a stranglehold on the market following the insane success of the NES. Mario Mania had taken the world by storm, but behind closed doors, Sega was working on their secret weapon to take the plumber down. Mr. Needle Mouse, or at least that's what they called him at first. It doesn't quite roll off the tongue as well as Sonic the Hedgehog, but fast forward a bit to what may have been some of the greatest marketing in the gaming industry, and Sonic has become a household name. I was only three at the time, but they hooked me good, and as someone who was already gaming, I knew I wanted to play Sonic the Hedgehog. He was so fast, so cool. My friendship with Sonic began with Sonic 1 and continued with every new game that followed. I couldn't get enough. We had a bit of a falling out following the Secret Rings and Boost era, but some of you already know that, and while I've literally played these games hundreds of times, I couldn't tell you the last time that I sat down and ran through the classics. Pun not intended. Now, with Sonic Origins out, I feel like it's a great excuse to revisit the games that made me fall in love with our little blue homie. And with that being said, the Sonic Origins adventure begins now, but only after you make sure you're subscribed. All right, so Sonic Origins is finally here, which gives me an excuse to play through all the classic Sonic games again. And I know these games come out once a year, but I really haven't rebought them since, I don't know, like the Sonic Mega Collection on GameCube. I love how they added cutscenes, and I love how they continued the Mania style. Here's Dr. Eggman, he's got all the animals. There's really no story here. They're setting up the most vanilla stories, like, all right, we got all the animals, time to go. And then they're like, get to work. Green Hill Zone, iconic. Music, sound effects, visuals, everything about it. And honestly, Sonic Mania was the last 2D Sonic game that I played. Probably launch. I haven't played any 2D Sonic games since. Like, I don't remember the last time I picked up Sonic 1 or 2. Sonic doesn't have Spin Dash in Sonic 1, right? Oh no, he does. Did he not originally? Did they add it? I mean, I've put years of my life into these games, so. You guys are about to see some of the best 2D Sonic gameplay in your lives. Wait, hang, oh, hang on, don't miss that. All right, we got 50 rings here, so we can get a Chaos Emerald. Is it 50? I think it's 50 rings, right? Oh, this is nauseating. No, not that way, not that way. No, not that way either. This definitely made me less sick as a kid. Oh, great. No Chaos Emerald for us. Do I want to retry? Sure. So we're playing in anniversary mode, which has all kinds of tweaks and cutscenes, and it's in 16.9 uh, and... You know, all things that Sonic should not be. I just, I need the Chaos Emeralds. Please, don't go in no I think in this mode they gave it the Mario Odyssey treatment where there's no lives and you just have rings and, or coins? You collect rings, but I think you have coins to like retry and stuff. All right, let's get in there. Get, get me in there. Put me in, coach. Thank you. Oh, he was just hiding in there. I thought we had to get 50 rings for some reason. I have 101 coins. So how many do they take away when you die? You know, you didn't have to fly, like, right there. You saw me getting on the platform. Ah, speed shoes. Now I can't be beaten. Yeah, Dr. Eggman, throw whatever you can my way. Where is he hiding? I just, I just want to talk. Oh, I got, <laughs> I got the speed shoes in the tree. I didn't even see those. Thank you. Next, putting the monies. See, they say money don't grow on trees, but whoever said that has never played Sonic the Hedgehog. Hello there. All right, time for probably one of the most iconic boss fights in any 16-bit game. I'm going to do it without getting hit, too. That's how us professionals do it. Come here. Swing those big old balls over here, Dr. Eggman. Jeez, how many hits do you need? It doesn't count. I didn't get hit because I had a shield. Uh, I, I didn't get hit. It, that was it was a flu that was a glitch. Man, they really need to patch this game. It's so buggy. Sega, how could you sell us such a buggy product? Is really the only way to get him out of there to detonate the entire thing? They're like fragile little animals, and we're like, all right, let's blow it up. You know what's funny? Like, going back 30 years and just being like a three-year-old or four-year-old playing Sonic 1, just someone walking up to that kid and being like, hey, you're gonna do this for a living one day. Isn't that weird? And I'm like, I'm gonna be Sonic the Hedgehog? N not really, but the next best thing. I don't know what it was about some of these zones that just kind of instilled fear in me when I was younger. Like, definitely Marble Zone. I don't know what it is about the lava and the spikes. Look at those spikes. They're menacing. We're just, like, getting crushed by these pillars. Ooh, God. Like, I don't want to get crushed by this thing either. I don't know. When you're, like, three or four years old, you're afraid of weird stuff. Marble Zone just has an aura about it. Which way do I want to go? I guess the way that's not going to burn me. Oh, God. I don't want to end up like Anakin Skywalker. Ah! Like, what is preventing that lava from moving? Woo! 
Oh, okay. This is the worst theme park ride ever. Oh, oh, there goes my shield. It always be the lone fireballs. Oh, great. Thanks a lot, damn bees. <laughs> we hit his butt and he's still. Oh, God. Oh, invincibility. I need it. So, the funny thing about the invincibility is I could still be crushed. So, be on your toes, Sonic. Look at him just sitting there waiting, smiling. Sonic's like, I'm waiting too, you know. Wow, three Marble Zone X? In this economy? Do you know what Marble costs nowadays? Did I really lose rings to the butt? Just the butt bouncing? Just that robot caterpillar's fat dumpy? You know, I had that one coming. There's not really a lot of, uh, gotta go fast in Marble Zone. It's more like stop and wait. Oh, that scared the hell out of me. Oh, I could've went up there. Oh, God. There we go. All right. Stop and smell the lava. I think there's something up there, but you know what? I don't know if I want to test it. I feel like there's a secret up here. There is. There's no lives in this game. And let me tell you, I know things about not having a life. Ow. Don't you just feel like you've been going in circles for a while? Marble Zone is the real Labyrinth Zone. Oh, wait. Hang on. No. No. Don't stick me with the pointy yoga. No. 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 No, no, no. Chalk that one up to stupidity. You gotta have the Zelda mentality in this game. Bomb every wall, burn every bush. But instead of like using cool things, you just gotta push on stuff. Oh, again, deja vu, man. This is a patient man's game. Sonic is not patient. Try it, stupid. Is that really the best you could do here? You just have like the little diarrhea flamethrower. Look, he just drops like a little fire turd. He just got rocked. The second boss fight should not be easier than the first boss fight. Spring Yard Zone. I love this stage. Mostly because the soundtrack is just a bop. All right, I'm gonna fly through this now. Literally flying through it. Excuse me, Mr. Krabs. What is this? Oh, a shortcut. Don't mind if I do. Oh, a spring at the beginning of the stage? I guess you want me to use it. That was anticlimactic. Is it up there? CPU? Don't roll into the spike, Sonic. You're smarter than that. You're better. That's something Mario would do. Oh crap, I need a ring. There we go. I don't remember what the uh, the boss of this stage is though. So that's, uh, that's gonna be eye-opening to remember that. Oh, get, the, get the thing. I don't know how Sonic doesn't have a migraine. Okay, I've been to like a total of one bonus stage and that was it. Then I wasn't good enough to, <laughs> to get enough rings. Oh, uh, uh, there we go. Keep me, nope, don't. Don't, don't. I have better things to do. Oh God, this is brutal. If you're watching this, I'm sorry. Ugh, where, I can't even get past this part. I wanna know what uh, Yuji Naka and his team were thinking when they made this game and they did the bonus stage. They were like, all right, I don't know, put birds in the background. Sonic's definitely tripping on acid for this. Never ever take medicine that isn't yours. All right, there's the emerald. He's gonna get past the Culex crystals and the peppermint candies. You were thinking the same thing. Don't lie. If I don't get it this time, I'm leaving. Come on, get, get, get it. Get this, no boy. Oh God, no. Oh, oh, oh. oh, oh how bad do I want the emerald? Not that bad, to be honest. Sonic, we've been here four hours. Can we go home now? I'm tired. I want to see my family. Oh God. All right, that's two emeralds. I mean, I'm definitely not going to get all of them, but I want to say that I tried. Don't smush me. Sonic's like Big Toe could get crushed and like that. Oh, you <sighs> Wait a second. Wait, we have the drop dash in this? Isn't that a new mechanic from Sonic CD? Did they just like give Sonic everything? That's, that's weird. Uh, am I wrong uh, about this? Have they done that in previous Sonic collections? There go all my rings. Cope? What do you mean cope? With what? Does the next one say seed? Oh, I remember now. Okay. Ow! He, yeah, he removes them. Just, you can't really miss too many times. Just, once there's big gaps, like, it's very easy to die. Just hit him a few times. One more hit. Yeah, whatever. What? How did I? I clipped through the floor! Still better than Sonic 06, though. Really? Not a single ring? Fine. I don't need it. Yeah, drive the spike into my head. Watch what happens. No double bouncing, huh? Can I keep this? Probably not. Hey, maybe I can. Is this how speedrunners do it? Like myself? That's fine. That's the one I wanted you to take anyway. Got him. And I'll just free more of the animals. I, I feel almost compelled to do a Sonic Says after I finish a new zone. You should free all the animals and be like, if you're constipated, make sure you take plenty of colace. Uh-oh, water. Sonic hates water. Give me the bubble. I don't care about the money. I need the bubble. 
I just don't want to hear the drowning music. This is where the game got me as a kid. Told you, my first bout with anxiety was uh, definitely the Sonic Drowning theme. I mean, I'll wait here for 20 seconds if it means I can get a breath of fresh air. All right. Oh, no. Don't like this. Where's all the bubbles? This must be what it felt like when Sandy took off her helmet in the Krusty Krab. Fuck you. That was dumb. All right, let's not get crushed this time. What did that do? What did I open? I mean, it's not really much of a labyrinth. I think it's pretty linear. You guys like how they put Labyrinth Zone in uh, the Sonic 2 movie? That was dope. Nope. Okay, let's hop on this piece of cheese. I always thought they looked like a piece of cheese when I was a kid. No, no, no! I almost got crushed. I'm gonna drown. I hate it here. I hate it here. <laughs> Please let me out. This is only Act 1. All right, we passed Act 1. Some of you in the comment section don't know how to act. This might be a hot take, but uh, Sonic 1 is my least favorite of... Uh, the original Sonic games. Maybe it's a zone thing. Maybe I just, I don't care for these zones as much as I do for games like Sonic 2 and 3. I'm not counting Sonic CD. Sonic CD is uh, a little bland. You know, I was talking to my friend about Sonic 1 recently, and um, if you think about it, there's a lot of waiting around for things to happen. Like, there's a lot of obstacles you kind of just have to wait for, and I know you could combat that by saying, oh, uh, Chalk, you just have to learn the levels then you speed run them and that's how you play. I don't think so. I, I don't think that's a catch-all for some of the, the waiting you have to do in this game. Like in Marble Zone, just a bunch of rocks you have to stand on. It's not very gotta go fast. So maybe Mario did win the console war in the 90s. Oh, wait, I'm taking, give me, give it back. It's the only one I have. All right, can't be stopped now. I'm sparkly Sonic, but I think I can still drown. I'm not 100% sure. Yep, that, uh, that poor penguin's gonna drown, or whatever the hell it was. I know Dr. Eggman is turning all the animals into robots, but it's gotta be really messed up to turn, like, a non-water... I got crushed. I was just saying how it's kind of messed up, like, to turn a non-water animal into a water robot, because then when you get freed like that, you have no choice but to drown. I think I'd rather be the robot. So Sonic actually murdered him. I'm gonna go this way. Nope, I guess not. See, like, that poor... whatever the hell it is... It's on borrowed time. Enjoy your last few minutes of life. Maybe it's actually a trap set by Dr. Eggman to make Sonic kill. They were better off as robots. Oh god, where is it? Where? No, drown. Oh no. Oh no. Where? Where's the bubbles? Where's the bubble? Please, throw it. Ooh! This is where claustrophobia was invented. And I'm sorry to anyone who actually suffers from claustrophobia. Where did you come from? You dropped on my head? You know, the water's coming. It's okay, I can outrun the water. I mean, I am Sonic. I'm faster than most things. Depends on what, uh, iterate- Oh! Okay, that's right, we can hit him on the way. Depends on what Sonic series you're watching, though, because, uh, according to the Saturday morning cartoon, he's the fastest thing alive. Thank you, Sega, for, um, making this game lifeless in anniversary mode, so I don't have to worry about game overs. Because as a kid, this was brutal without rings. Again. Again- Ooh! In my comment section, is gonna be like, oh, well, Chalk, if you uh, just go to the left, there's a hidden ring box. Well, shut up. I'm too busy running away from the water because it scares me. All right, I'm not gonna make the same mistake this time. Mistake of impatience. And yeah, maybe Sonic's gotta get a little bit wet. Okay, I'm really screwed now. Anyway, hey, wait, how is his ship working underwater? He doesn't even have a dome on it. Oh, timing. Hang on, timing could be everything here. There we go. I just had it. I just had to escape. You better run. That's it? I was just struggling with basic platforming. Oh God, I love Starlight Zone so much. I don't know, it's just something about Starlight Zone. You run against the fans, then you just like, oh, that, how do I do it again? Run against the fan, you just, woo! Nope, that didn't work. Never mind. Okay, I guess we're not going that way. Can we jump over the fan? Uh, video game coding says no. I should be using Drop Dash much more than I am. Oh, get, come back for it. Here we go. You know, I don't know if I have the patience to keep doing this. Just want to make that clear. They give you coins in a game where you collect rings. It just, it seems a little sacrilegious. And they give you lots of them. So you can just keep doing this. You can give yourself a migraine. So you want to like get in as it's turning. So you can kind of just sit there for a minute like this. Like this one, we got it. I'm surprised with how fast I got this one though. Oh, where'd he go? This just in, uh, Elon Musk has uh, launched Sonic the Hedgehog into space. The Starlight Zone theme just makes me so happy. 
Is it me or is that one really short? All right, so after uh, Starlight Zone, which is just like a nice palette cleanser, we gotta go Scrap Brain, which is probably the most raw name for a zone in any Sonic game. Oh, you thought you were gonna get me, but I stood right on, okay. Ah, uh, this is a fun boss fight. I like this one. You gotta throw him back up into him. Or you could probably just, I don't know, launch yourself. That's probably better. I mean, either way is fun. Come here, just bam. Once you find a good rhythm too, that's Starlight Zone. Probably my favorite zone in Sonic 1. So now we gotta go to Scrap Brain. And you know what happens in Scrap Brain. I like how they call it Scrap Brain because I got a Scrap Brain. We gotta go in where the cheese grater gets us. There we go, oh God. Don't crush me, please. It's all about the angles here. Geometry, kids. Oh, almost got torched. Too many jump scares in Sonic 1. Or maybe I'm just creating them. See, like, why, that thing don't gotta follow me. Why, why you gotta follow me? Why, why you gotta put that there? What I wanna know is, how the hell was three-year-old me doing any of this? Because I've beaten Sonic 1. Oh, that's right, they got the Mega Man blocks here. You know, the ones that are like, meow, meow, meow. And you gotta like wait for the patterns. Look a little bit like a seven layer cookie. It's crazy like how much I don't remember. Because like I said, I've played this game so many times, but not in recent years. I think it's because I just know it's widely available everywhere. Because I know the game's always available, I'm just, I, I don't play it. I'm having a bad time. I'm, I'm not having fun. Woo, okay, all right, that works. Ooh, ah. Just gonna start from the beginning, okay. <laughs> oh, cool, thanks for the random buzz saw. Who built this place? It's a death trap. I mean, it, Scrap Brain has employees, right? So the correct answer there is not anymore, Chuck. Not anymore. All right, a little bit of invincibility. Finally, some good news. I'm realizing now that there is no Super Sonic in this game, so I don't know why I was trying to collect all the emeralds, because uh, I'm pretty sure it's just like a slightly different ending. Super Sonic wasn't invented until Sonic 2, because Goku needed to go Super Saiyan for, actually he went Super Saiyan way, way before that. So my timelines don't match up. Scrap Brain 2, out of the way. Sonic's like, all right, Dr. Eggman, I've got you. Oh wait, you got this anti-hedgehog force field up. I like how they give you only a little cutscene going into uh, Scrap Brain 3, which just feels like Labyrinth 2. Take me where there's no water as I go deeper and deeper into the purple ocean. There's gotta be some bubbles here somewhere. Hello? 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 Oh, please, 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 it's right! I, I mean, I got the checkpoint, so I guess I could just die. What if Sonic, like, unknowingly inhaled a bubble and it just turned out to be, like, someone's fart bubble? Ah! Ah! Gotta get a ring. Like Beyonce said, if you like it, you should have put a ring on it. Do your worst, Spike Boy. Ha! You're bald. Oh, good rings. Rings, rings, rings. I'll stand here and I'll jump in place until I get a damn bubble. That was stupid and I hate it. Oh God, please. Oh, there's rings here. That does me no good. I need air. <laughs> of course. Okay, dodge that. Oh, I'm gonna drown. Doesn't matter. No, nothing matters. Oh wait, air, air. I'm pretty sure scuba diving has less air management than a Sonic game. Whoa, okay, we just launched out of there into the final zone which is really just a boss fight. The hardest boss fight, like the difficulty spike here is crazy. Like you don't gotta memorize patterns. Gotta figure out which piston Dr. Eggman's gonna be hanging out in. I hit him, I hit him. Okay, maybe there's really no difficulty spike. It's actually kinda easy. 19 hits. Me hitting you, you hitting the ground, and then me listening to Blink-182's greatest hits. There we go. All right, he's dead. I'm out of here. And somehow he can outrun me. All right, that's it. Dr. Eggman took off. Mobius is saved. All these animals, except for the ones that, uh... We don't, we don't talk about them. But most of the animals are saved. All right, Sonic, you got all the Chaos Emeralds. Or at least in this cutscene, you did. We didn't collect all of them, but I appreciate you giving them all to us. We just send them back to the motherland. They scatter like the Dragon Balls. So, what are we, starting off playing poker? Is Amy doing tarot cards? She's like, I will make Sonic love me. So Sonic CD is actually the one I have the least familiarity with. And I owned a Sega CD, but 
I ended up selling it when I was young, so I just haven't replayed Sonic CD in recent times. But like I said, it, I haven't replayed any of the classic Sonic games in recent times. Oh, and the cards are gone. Sonic CD does have a banger title track, though. Ah, uh, Palm Tree Panic. Why are we panicking, though? They look okay. A lot of mosquitoes. This is cool. We can kind of like charge up before we have to run. I mean, it's just a different version of a spin dash. Past? Future? Okay, so uh, we're, we're time traveling now. That's the whole gimmick of Sonic CD. We're going to the future. So this is the future? Why is everything chrome? Future! What is this? Get real dizzy, Sonic. Okay, we, we need to go to the past. Just, I, I don't like it here. In fact, I hate it. I think I missed my opportunity. I missed my window to time travel right there. I'm gonna say though, in terms of replaying classic Sonic games, the one that has the longest gap between replays, 100% Sonic CD. Because I don't even remember when I got rid of my Sega CD. Definitely regret that though, even though <laughs> there were like three games that I played. Kill old mosquitoes. Nobody likes mosquitoes. Is there anyone out there besides, I don't know, like bats? that like mosquitoes. Don't bats eat mosquitoes? In fact, if I could rid the earth one thing, probably be mosquitoes. I wanna go to the past. Stop sending me to the future. Or I guess I gotta stop sending myself to the future. I gotta go home. I gotta get to the past. All right, no more future travel. I do love his run animation in this game though. Boss fight number one. All right, Dr. Eggman, if it's a duel you want, a duel you'll get. Wait a second. Wait, <laughs> one jump? That's all it took? I guess materials have gotten uh, significantly worse in the future. Oh my god, Dr. Eggman, you gotta stop importing all your metals. All right, collision chaos. I think, oh, hi, Amy. All right, let's go. Oh, wait, no, give her, I mean, I guess you could take her. I don't, I don't wanna go to the future. I think I'm, I think I'm done with the future. It's bleak, I don't like what happens. I will say that when I was younger, I always thought Sonic CD was a better game, but looking back as an adult, I know that a lot of the stages just seem very bland and uninspired. And it's just the colors, man. The colors are a lot in this game. Ow! Boomer Kawanger! Why? Good God, this is nauseating. I won't lie, when I booted up the game, I was like, oh good, Sonic 2 is next. Not realizing that they put Sonic CD first and we're gonna go in order. So you're, just, you're gonna have to wait for Sonic 2, the real masterpiece of this collection. Sonic got through zone one. Yeah, barely. I mean, they were honest with the name. It's called Collision Chaos, and there's a lot of collision and chaos and very bright clashing colors. Maybe the collision is the, the palette choice. Future, okay, maybe. Maybe we can get out of here. Can we do it? No, I want to go to the past! I'll be honest though, Collision Chaos already seems like the future, so I'm confused. It kind of seems like we're in the past, but I hit it the last second, so I really don't know. And it's been so long, so uh, comment section. Did I end up in the past or the future here? Okay, wait, there's uh, there's Metal Sonic. Wait, there was Metal Sonic. Bastards, let me go! Let me go! I'm having a rough time, people. I'm just, I'm, I'm just having a rough time right now. Yeah, like, this already seems futuristic. Do we need another future? Oh, sorry, didn't mean to break that. Unless it was a bad thing, in which case... I'm kind of happy I broke that. We just inserted a worse Sonic Spinball into this game. I think Sonic Spinball gets unnecessary hate. I don't know if I'm blinded by nostalgia, but I kind of like it. Although it is hard as balls. As a kid, I don't think I ever made it past the first stage. There we go. There we go. There we go. Get back here. Get back here. Why is this stage the end of the world? Oh, great. Fantastic. Underwater. I don't know, there's just something about it being like Fisher Price colors that doesn't make it as menacing. I think that's probably one of my other big gripes with Sonic CD is that the colors are very bright and very clashy. How do you expect me to go fast underwater? All right, you guys know the deal. Come on, go. F I'm supposed to go fast. It makes you wonder if it's even possible if you do hit one of the signs. Can you build up enough speed underwater? Whoa, what the? I was not expecting that. Oh, hello, bonus zone. I try, I got one of these uh, three D, oh, damn it. <laughs> it's just, Sonic just flatlined. I got one of these 3D or mock 3D bonus zones. I know it seems like I'm doing a lot of uh, complaining about this game. I actually, I like Sonic CD. It's just, I think I used to like it more is what I'm trying to say. 
destroy you. Oh no, my rings! All right, everyone's dead. Give me the emerald. Oh, hang on. Bubble stop. It's like a Tesla charging station, but specifically for Sonic. Hello? Hello? Where's the, where's the bubble? Oh God, that was so close. God, I'm just, I'm just trying to escape this hell hole. Past. No! Oh cool, we stay on the log no matter which way we go. You guys probably already know about it, but we're, we're gonna talk about it. Remember that weird mechanic that they added to Sonic 3 where you have to press up and down to control like the barrel? That had no explanation and nobody even knew that's how it operated. See so like, all right, I'm gonna hit this, try to go to the future, but can I build up enough speed? Like there's the goal, but yep, sorry. Not much time travel this run. The whole point of Sonic CD is time travel, and I'm not doing really any of it. Blame my poor Sonic CD skills and level design. Oh, we hit him. Bopped him. Get over here. Get back here. Get back here. This is like easier labyrinth zone. <laughs> we just smacked him in the head. Oh, now you want to go fast. Sorry, sir. That's my mantra. Stop, stop taking all the bubbles. You're going to share those, right? Oh, that's hilarious. I can essentially run out of air bubbles. I'm just trying to drink that Dr. Eggman bath water. Oh, I'm gonna be so screwed. Oh, we got him. It was only one hit. All right, quartz quadrant time. We're, we're definitely making this one. We're definitely going fast enough here. To the future. Oh, they got bugs in the future. Damn, I lost my rings to a snail. A lot of this just feels new again. Okay, <laughs> we just did the same thing twice. Isn't the whole story here that Dr. Eggman is after not the Chaos Emerald this time, but like the Time Stones? Wait, 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 oh, come on. We we're so close to going to the past. You're like, now let me hit a, a pass sign because then I'll just, I'll run so fast. Where is it when I need it? I'm gonna do it, hang on. Ah, one of these days, Sonic, just not today. I mean, who would wanna travel to the past? I would relive my childhood over and over again. And you know what, that's a, that's a great question. If you could time travel to one point in time in your past, what would it be? Like, give me an age. What, what was the best age for you? I feel like I'd go back to nine and live onward again from nine. Assuming that I can just do all the same stuff again, because I, I kind of kind of like where I am right now in life. We're getting very deep in meta here. Don't drop your balls on me. So we just gotta buy time until he like sands himself into the ground. He's like, uh-oh, running out of metal. He's doing the I gotta pee dance. He's like, I gotta put more bathrooms in quartz quadrant. Wacky workbench. Surprise the boss fight here is not him the tool man taylor whoa that thing launched me all right we go down the tubes the time travel tubes oh that's right we have hanging mechanics in this game oh god sonic cd is a metroidvania i mean what the game lacks in creativity and level design it definitely makes up for it in exploration because being able to travel between multiple time periods but also the levels are bigger than they've ever been Hello, which way is the past? H how does one get there? Come on, please! Rah! I'm gonna open that, go in here. What if you accidentally go into like one of the sewage pipes? Like you think Mario has that problem a lot? You think he, he comes out of the pipes every now and then, you know, he, he's smelling a little funky? Luigi, this was Bowser's uh, sewage pipe. They give Sonic some ball and sprite art in this game. All the new poses are so fun and cool. All right, come on, this, we gotta build up speed here. Thank you. This entire video is just me just trying to time travel backwards. Um, I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. You know what? I think I preferred the uh, the present or the future of, of this. At least it's a nice day out. You got that cotton candy sky. Do you guys remember Kinex? This stick that we're spinning around on reminds me of like the long Kinex piece. Kinex was like really cool Legos. And Legos are cool, but Kinex were like future Legos. I don't even know if Kinex still exist. I feel like we might have lost them to time. But some of those pieces are really hard to snap together and pull apart. Sometimes you end up breaking one of the sticks. So if Kinex did go under, maybe it was for a good reason. All right, now the boss fight. Also, the boss fights in this game are not even very memorable. No? Okay. Was I supposed to hit him? I was afraid to fall down, so I didn't even try. My guy, Dr. Robotnik's been playing a lot of Minecraft. Okay, that didn't work. And my rings. Oh, I got one. I don't even want to try again. Ouch! Have I died yet? I don't think I have. We might have to... Is that it? I'm gonna catch you. Um, honestly, Sonic should just be able to catch Dr. Robotnik and, like, rip his head off. It's like, spin dash, buzzsaw, him into pieces. I don't know if that's a canon thing, but in Adventures of Sonic the Hedgehog, for some reason, they made his spin dash a buzzsaw. All right, the Stardust Speedway, which is made entirely out of trombones. 
Oh, we got no problem time traveling now. What's the future of the Stardust Speedway? What becomes of it? Oh, shit! It becomes a nightclub in the future. Although there's nobody here, they probably got some weird ratios going on. Never much of a club person. Honestly, going out, I'd prefer a nice crappy dive bar. This might be the fastest we've gone all game. And I haven't died once. We're gonna beat the game completely deathless. I wanna see what the past is like. Let's go here. Will, thi will this work? It should work. Ha <laughs> ha, it works! Oh damn, Stardust Speedway is good in every form. Speaking of games of time travel, I'm actually playing Chrono Trigger for the first time now. Just that's what I'm casually playing through because I've never played Chrono Trigger. I don't know why it escaped me on the Super Nintendo, which is my favorite console. I feel like definitely a game that at some point everyone should have played, but I, I didn't. So I'm having a good time with Chrono Trigger lately. And Frog is my favorite character so far. But that's probably not going to change because Frog's pretty badass. Yeah, Stardust Speedway slaps. Making me a little dizzy, but I do be slapping. No, come on. <laughs> why put that there? Why? Why troll like that? Oh, that's right. Sonic made a good future in Zone 2. You want to try and finish the stage in certain iterations. Okay, I clearly haven't done that enough. Hoo -hoo -hoo! Okay, pick up the pace, Sonic. Look, we got fight metal now. Hey, that's my thing. Yeah, you do it, Sonic. You show him. Wave your finger. Ow! How did I die? I had 13 rings. All right, uh, we're not doing it completely deathless. There's a death. So much for making a good future. Race time. There can only be one Sonic. Do you guys like Metal Sonic or Mecha Sonic better? Or Silver Sonic? Which Robo Sonic are we going? I feel like for me, it's gotta be Metal and then Mecha and then Silver. <laughs> he did the dying animation. Oh, can't get me in here, Dr. Eggman. Can't reach me. Oh, you could've just went past. Okay, that's fine. Oh, here's Amy, let's free you. Hey, 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 I'm working. I'm on the clock. Man, I forgot how short this game is. I think I've been playing for like, I don't know, a total of 45 minutes and uh, we are already in the final stage. Okay, go to the future or not. I know the point of this game is really to get as many good futures as you can, um, but that's not happening here. Guess we're just, we're just playing to beat the game, we're being casual. Almost did this completely deathless and I got some random BS death on the last boss. And I was looking at a walkthrough just because I wanted to read up on some of the, uh, the things that I missed. Like for example, I was unsure about the time travel aspect. So I paused, I was like, oh, let me look this up. Go to gamefacts.com, like it's the year 2001 again. And uh, I'm trying to figure out if we could get Sonic in Smash by shooting all of the credits in Melee. And specifically in the guide, it says Sonic CD bosses are very hard. Um, no, they're not. No, they indeed are not. Sonic 1 is definitely more difficult. Sonic CD, short and easy. You know, it's another game that I haven't played in a hot minute. Knuckles Chaotix. I think I was one of like six people that bought a 32X. Actually, I didn't buy a 32X. My dad came home one day with a 32X. The same he did with a Sega CD. All right, we gotta just take these robot legs over here. These robot legs uh, gonna make me act up. I, I mean, uh, what? Oh, come on! Oh, that's right. You can be Baby Sonic! <laughs> Look at him! Why is he only in this stage? They should have utilized this way more. He's so small. Please protect him with your life. Okay, here's a speed shoe that we haven't broken. Now we're fast, small Sonic. Okay, we're big now. Big Sonic. Well, that was fun and novel. One thing they definitely did right in this game, like I said, is there's just... They, they tried different things. That was dumb. Didn't die at all until, like, the last few minutes of this game. We gotta wait for the falling elevators. We really need to... Uh, okay. Ah! Dude! It appeared out of nowhere! Okay, I don't know if there was another one coming. Oh, we're close to the goal, too. We died right there. We gotta stand here with the invincibility and just wait for the floor to fall. Some real Bell and Wonder World platforming here. I know, this game came 20 years before. Oh, hello. What do you got there? You got some really weird mechs in this game. Okay, fine. Whatever. No, no. All right. Cool. Great. Okay, maybe this was the hardest boss because I died one time. Come down here. It's got a pogo stick. All right, now he's dead. Sonic's like, I'm just gonna wait here for Amy while everything blows up. All right, and then we have our ending cutscene where Sonic grabs Amy and they rush off, and then he totally dips. He's like, I have to go to the bathroom. If the waiter comes with the bill, just 
I'll be right back. And then he doesn't come back. Wait, Sonic, you don't have a pilot's license. Or do you? And Amy's like back to doing tarot cards. I hope he calls me. Huh, two tails. A chaos emerald. What could this mean? What it, oh, they're gone. You might wanna like, I don't know, get some rocks to hold him down. And then Sonic flew off into the distance, into the next game. Sonic 2, the introduction of Tails. This is where the Sonic games start getting good. They got him cornered. They don't grab his Tails. I didn't know bullying existed in Mobius. Sonic's like, uh, hey, who's this dude following me? Playing the game as it was meant to be, with Tails following me and likely just going to die constantly. I mean, he did that in uh, Sonic 06. You know, I'm gonna say what everyone's thinking. I like Emerald Hill Zone better than Green Hill Zone. Look how good I am at Sonic 2. I already got a one-up. That's because Sonic 2 is probably the Sonic game that I played most. Hey, that's me. What I want to know is where did Tails learn to spin dash? Like, Sonic does it and he's like, all right, I'm gonna copy you. But like, hedgehogs naturally can ball up. He's a fox. Look at this, the speedrun strats. You didn't know you were watching chalk games done quick. To the special stage we go. Get 40 rings, no problem. I think out of all the special stages, this one might be my fave. Look, 36 rings. Throw a challenge at me. Give me that Chaos Emerald. It's a little nerve wracking, because you're like, oh crap, I gotta get him, and then like they throw me so fast. There we go, easy. I'm gonna try to get all the Chaos Emeralds because I, I wanna see Super Sonic. So when I was young, I used to just go straight to debug mode and level select. Then for some reason, just go immediately to Wing Fortress Zone and get Super Sonic. I think out of all the 2D Sonic games, Sonic 2's boss fight music is probably the best. I got a lot of crap for not using the Japanese soundtrack when I played CD, but you know what? I didn't think to switch it over. The Japanese soundtrack is obviously better. I just, I don't know, I started playing the game. I, I didn't think, hey, let me change the soundtrack, although I probably should have, because the US soundtrack is awkward as hell. Speaking of soundtracks, Chemical Plan is probably a top five in every Sonic game ever. Don't you dare. Oop, sorry. Damn it, stupid tubes. I'm just a broke little hedgehog trying to collect some rings. All right, seven to go. Bam, give me a checkpoint. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Waiting to, oh damn. All right, we'll just roll into act two. Kind of feel for anyone that works at Chemical Plant Zone, because they have to like go up and down these hills. Downhill is probably easy, but then you gotta like go uphill if like you're going to lunch or something. All right, come on, 44, 50. Where is it? Something just waited and take my rings away and know it. Oh, here we go. You know, my friend and I went to PAX one year and we heard a remix of a uh, Hotel Motel Holiday Inn, whatever the hell the name of that song is, remixed with this and I could just never find it online. They were just like playing it in a queue. I've just never heard that piece of art ever again. All right, so far, so good. Gotta avoid the, the bombs. Bombs, bad. Oh, oh, no, damn it. No, oh crap. Uh, I need 29 rings, this ain't happening. I, I messed up. Oh, oh, we can retry, that's right. Oh, this is just gonna make it so easy to get Super Sonic. Also, I just really love this special stage, so I, I can play this over and over. Just give me a whole ass game like this. I gotta get more rings just to create a buffer, because uh, you guys saw how that last try went. Oh, it's happening again, it's happening. Oh no! All right, all right, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're in, we're in. All right, two for two. Don't fall in the water, I please, I don't, I don't wanna, all right, Tails, you fall in the water, that's fine. Beat the rising water. I just, I, I don't want to, I don't want to hear the music. This whole series is just me reliving. Oh no! This whole series is just me reliving my traumatic childhood experience. It, oh, I got crushed. That's cool. Why is my gameplay just drastically better from like Sonic 1 and CD to 2? I don't know if it's only because I played this game so much or just like the level design is also much better. Immediately put foot inside mouth. Hey, don't, don't you dare spill that blue stuff on me. Don't you dare spill that blue stuff. I don't even like the blue Gatorade. It's the worst. Why are you boring me? I'm right. I lied. The ice blue one is good. The dark blue one, bottom tier. Hey, it's Grounder. Oh, hang on. Bubble time. Oh, wait a second. Tails, you stole my bubble. I'm gonna die. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on, please. Ooh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, God. Oh, we're on zero. Tails stole the air that I breathe. Tails, you're dead to me. I like how there's just no indicator of when he's going to die. He just does. Come on, Tails, we're leaving. Too many mosquitoes here. Just look at this, flying, zooming. You know, I just need to face my fears head on. I'm just gonna start listening to the jingle casually. Come on, that was, that was so stupid. All right, I'm just gonna hang out up here. This is the speed run of strats I don't tell you about. It just got crushed. Can I reach? Come on, like one more hit. 
die! Ah, uh, yes. Sonic and Tails go gambling. Alright, I messed up. I didn't get the third emerald in that zone, so it's fine. Got plenty more zones to get it. I used to love playing two-player Casino Night Zone, like the versus mode with, like, my friends or, like, my dad. The elevator left without me. And it's weird, like, a little stretched orientation and not figuring out for a while that you actually have to hold the jump button here. I said this before, but can I just, like, travel back in time just to confront my, like, three-year-old self? Or maybe I was a little older when, uh, Sonic 2 came out, so confront my five-year-old self to be like, listen, one day, you're gonna have, like, a hundred thousand people watch you play this game. You're not gonna be any better at it, but people are gonna watch, and that's really cool. No, seriously, that, that actually is, like, I think about it, and it's kind of surreal, and as of... This recording, we just passed 500,000 subs, and I cannot be more grateful, all of you, for just letting me, like, do me, live my dreams, and I get to be myself. I really couldn't ask for anything more than that. All right, I'm getting sappy, but what I need to get is good, because we got emeralds to collect. I'm very proud of Sonic and Tails for making it through two zones of a casino and not being tempted to stop and play some slot machines. Oh, come on, Sonic, I was just talking you up. All right, just one more pull. You can't lose twice. To be honest, I'm surprised they even let Tails in the casino. Because canonically, he's what, like seven or nine? Hey! Why is he in the slot machine? Tails, is there something you want to tell me? Did you just sell yourself to Konami? You only making pachinko machines now? If you lose Tails, you just hear him jumping for eternity. And into the special stage we go. All right, okay. Gonna do it on the first try, I promise. For people that are really good at this or actual speedrunners, like, I want to know, what's the strat here? Well, I mean, I guess the strat if you're speedrunning is just don't do the special stages. Oh, Tails. Come on, man. Told you to hold the rings. Whoop! Okay. Tails, you're fired. But I don't even work here! I gotta really front load this one. It's like it gets kind of dicey towards the end. I just need to get as many rings as I can early on. Also, just knowing that uh, Tails is gonna drop a bunch of them. Uh, uh, that was clearly Tails' fault. But that one was actually Tails' fault. Why do I have to be penalized for his mistakes? I'm not his guardian. We just made that one. That was so close. All right, here we go. Gonna pick up the slack. Damn it. Come on, Tails, when I jump, you jump. Oh, I hate it here. All right, I'm getting better at the uh, the anticipation of the... Okay, maybe not. Okay, come on, two rings. There's two rings, right? There's two... Come on! After this turn, there's gonna be a uh, jump. Damn it. Tails, come on, man. You're messing us up. All right, I'm gonna jump really early this time. Like, now. Ha! All right, hang on, I think I got it. I think, I think we got this one. Oh, come on! <laughs> I had it! You son of a bitch! Whoa! It's oh, so the last one! Can't really give you much room for error in this one. Case in point. Okay. Did we do it? Whoa! Oh, finally! Screw Special Stage 3. All my homies hate Special Stage 3. Oh, that's right. We're still in Casino Night Zone. Because we spent about four years in Special Stage. Oh, no! The Eggman! Oh, God. We almost got three of them. I was gonna say, it's probably bound to happen eventually if I just keep bouncing into it. I love this boss fight. Mainly because it's really satisfying to launch yourself off the, the wall at, like, Mach 1. You just fly into Eggman's warship. One. He's almost dead. One more. I've never actually counted the hits. I don't know how many it takes. Well, whatever it was, it was that many. It's like, I'm out of here. I'll see you guys at the craps table. Hilltop Zone. I've always loved Hilltop Zone. And, uh, Tails is dead again. Although, Hilltop Zone kind of scares me, because lava. So, it's a volcano. It's called Volcano Zone. Let's call it what it is, people. And not just any volcano, active Volcano Zone. I don't know why, but just the lava in Sonic games is very menacing. Must be all that blast processing that, uh, Sega was advertising in the 90s. Alright, we're underground now. Where you think there would be more lava? Oh, here, wait, here it is. Wait, don't, don't smush me. What is that guy? Little glowing ball head. These uh, these lifts over here, not very safe. Being held up by two vines, they break immediately. All right, okay, okay. No, nope, please don't crush me. Please don't crush me. Oh, okay. oh no, oh, ah, the lava, hot! Okay, let's just uh, head into the bonus zone real quick and another Chaos Emerald. I'm gonna do it on the first try this time, I promise. Tails is like, I'm helping. It's the turns that get you, because I can't see stuff that's coming up. Damn it, Tails! One ring, one ring. Oh, to rule them all! All right, we're almost there. Is that it? Did we get it? Yeah, I told you I was gonna do it first try. All right, zone one in the books. Uh oh. Nope. Okay, go here. Don't smush me. 
Tails, I'm sorry, you're probably dead again. We need 50 rings to enter a bonus? Ah, uh, yes. Excellent level design. Where did Tails go? I never know where that dude goes. All right, hang on, we're getting another one. Back-to-back -back emeralds. Oh, they're throwing rings up on the ceiling now. They're getting crazy. So I recently decided that I am starting a, a second solo channel, which you guys can go subscribe to. At the time of this recording, I don't have any content there, but it's gonna be used to post things that I feel wouldn't fit here. And I think one of the first videos I wanna do there is somebody released a Sonic Triple Trouble fan game that actually looks really dope. Up there on the ceiling. Yeah, that, that didn't work. Okay, the, the last one was really achievable. I just gotta, like, focus on those swirly bits. I'm talking about collecting rings like it's cereal. Why are these later bonus stages, like, much easier than some of the earlier ones? I'm just trying to get supersonic, like, really early in the game. Boss fight time! Oh, damn it, he's got a flamethrower! Hey, hang on, keep the ring, keep the one ring. This is how we win. Okay, I did it! I did it! Get out of the lava! Oh, hell yeah, it's Mystic Cave time. I love this zone because it's got, like, Castlevania vibes to it, which is something I didn't like until I got older. You know, I still have only ever played the first Castlevania game. You're gonna get a lot... Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, great. I'm gonna get a lot of comments telling me to go play more Castlevania games, and I will. It might be best suited for the Director's Cut channel, though. So this will make Chaos Emerald number six, and I can't remember, were there, um... Were there seven Chaos Emeralds in Sonic 2? Or was it six and then it was eventually changed? Or am I thinking of a different game? Oh, you're gonna get fancy, huh? Now you wanna get fancy. You wanna be a big shot. Really satisfying to just like hit a loop here. Only three rings to go, that's it? Did we do it? Too easy, man. All right, we've done it. And this is to go even further beyond! Oh, I guess it's seven Chaos Emeralds. Why did I think it was six in this game? I like how after you come out of like a beautiful mystical cave, you go to Oil Ocean Zone, AKA Corporate Pollution Zone. Just only the giant corporations of Mobius could create that much pollution. I don't want to lose my rings because I want to get that last emerald. So I'm not going to do it to a lightning bug. No little glowy butt's going to take my money from me. All right, here we go. The mission for the final Chaos Emerald. Man, I haven't manually collected the emeralds in ages. I told you guys, I would just go into like the debug menu and this is going very bad. I, okay, 63 rings to go. Yeah, right in my misery. See, I was talking smack about some of these uh, later bonus stages and I'm about to get what I deserve. Oh, hang on, jumping helps. Jumping is actually kind of the move. See, this is what I'm talking about. Oh, hang on, they tried to throw me off. That's cheating. Fool me once. Whoop! Oh, they're scattered. They're all over the place. Where's, where's the bombs, though? That's what I'm worried about. We got them. We, got, we just gotta hold on to them now. Oh, damn it, Tails. Oh, we got it! Oh, 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 we're done! That's the last emerald! It's supersonic time! And this is to go even further beyond! Huh? Oh, can I go supersonic? I have enough rings. I'm just gonna beat him with iframes. <laughs> Too easy. Can I go supersonic yet? There was 50 rings in jump. I had 105. Great, just the place I wanted to go supersonic for the first time, New Jersey. Is there any way out of the sludge water? I feel like this shouldn't even be allowed. Come on, get me out of here. Come on, I just wanna go supersonic, taking all my rings away from me. <laughs> it's not fair. All right, I gotta figure out this supersonic business because Work too hard for these emeralds. Oh, I remember this. This is fun. You just get to enjoy the the ride for a second. Sonic's like, hang on, let me jump into these cannons. No idea if he's just absorbing some kind of weird chemicals. All right, so I, I did uh, did some quick research. I was like, how do you go supersonic in Sonic 2? And uh, apparently, you have to double tap the jump button, which I don't think was ever the case. If I could, if I could get up there. If I, can I, if I can ever, I just want to see my family again. Just out here trying to collect my 50 rings so I can go supersonic. That's it, that's all I want. Simple things in life. Money, blonde hair. Oh, we're gonna fight the boss now? All right, fine. We'll, just, we'll go supersonic in the next stage. Stop it, stop it, stop, stop. This one's creepy because he's got like the stinger that comes out. My question is why would you want a submarine to go underneath that water? Why would you want to do that? And can you see anything? And I feel like the, the fire right there, that explosion, probably should have set this entire ocean ablaze. I, 
I feel bad letting these animals out. They're gonna get like oil stuck in their fur. We're gonna have to put them in the Dawn commercial. You know, you know the one where they clean the ducks with the soap? I like that commercial. Metropolis Zone is a banger, by the way. I didn't need to tell you that though. You, you kind of already knew. Oop, don't squish me. I'm trying to go supersonic. I have, I have an agenda. All right, we're gonna do it this time. We got a double tap apparently. I, I'm double tap, I'm triple tapping. How much tapping is needed? Bing, 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 bing. Oh, there we go. Did I just have to press like X? Why, why'd it take that many tries? I forgot what this power felt like. And we just gotta keep rings so um, we don't lose our super form. We just blaze through the rest of the game. He's so fast. Nothing can hurt me. I guess only time, time can hurt me. Look at it, the, the, the stance is so menacing. Look at that. The thing that sucks is, you have no rings and you're just completely vulnerable. So like now I can just die. <laughs> See, I think I can just fall here forever. Oh God, help. Oh, there we go. Metropolis zone, more like labyrinth zone, right? Cause it's already a zone. Going supersonic is funny cause Tails just has to like stand there and watch. You think Sonic thinks he's hot shit now? See like supersonic did this way faster. See like these spears don't even bother me. I am unbothered by pointy objects. I think it's hilarious that Sega was just like able to get away with this in uh, the 90s because like they blatantly ripped off Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball wasn't popular in the US yet. It would be another several years. Like I didn't start watching Dragon Ball till probably 96. Woo, almost got clipped there. Sonic almost went to the big zone in the sky. Well, actually, no, we're, we're going to the big zone in the sky soon. That would be Sky Chase Zone. You know, it was, it was a death joke. You, you get it. How did I miss every single one of those rings? Are you f Dude, that was some BS. Good thing I had a ring there, because they want to punish you for playing the game. All right, any second now, Sonic. Any, you're going to get there any minute. Don't you ever just sometimes feel like you're running in place? Metaphorically. Okay. Tails is like off screen somewhere just jumping for his life. Like, I don't know where. This guy's gonna kill me, isn't he? Oh, I, we killed him. Okay. Never mind. We'll die to something else. Okay, we go rings. Rings. Oh, no! Good thing we hit the checkpoint. Oh, I'm gonna grab those because we're going into boss fight right now. See, this one is just like, all right, just spam jump because you don't know, like, when you could hit him. Kind of a broken strategy. Wait, 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 look at the, look at the fake Robotnik. The balloon. Ooh, Tails, nice! He, just, he stole the glory. That's fine, we share it. We're partners. Now for Sky Chase Zone. The iconic zone where you're just riding on the tornado. It's a little bit peaceful, but also a little bit stressful. You got flying turtles, that doesn't really make sense. And they're like on bigger turtles. It's like Squirtle and Blastoise before Squirtle and Blastoise. Any rings? Oh, here, here we go. Okay, in a panic, I managed to miss every single one of them. Wing Fortress Zone. I know Wing Fortress Zone like the back of my hand. I have played this zone probably more times than any other zone in Sonic 2. I know where everything is. I know how to get my 50 rings and activate Super Sonic. And then follow my death immediately. I've done it all. I think I just used to jump to this zone immediately because I knew I can get 50 rings in like four seconds. No, it's actually probably good that they, ch oh, come on, am I really missing this jump twice? And poor Tails, Tails is like, I'm, I'm going down with the ship, Sonic. That's a real hero. So as I was saying, it's probably a good idea that they changed it so you have to actually activate Super Sonic because like I would get stuck using Super Sonic here, then I would like run out of rings, but I can't use it in Death Egg. So I'm gonna just have to eventually. Also, this is probably one of the worst zones for it in terms of just like trying to stay alive. It's very easy to fly off. Woo, okay. <laughs> Sonic just stancing. I'm so slippery. Oh god. Oh, big jump. Oh no, I missed. I got no rings now. I gotta do this like a peasant. Listen, I said I knew this uh, zone like the back of my hand. I never said I was good at it. There we go. All right. Now yeah, let's go supersonic. Okay, don't don't fly off the stage. Getting close to the end. We gotta just destroy the whole thing. Ah, you can't stop me. This boss fight is annoying though. You can't. You can't. I'm unstoppable. All right, Tails the homie, he's back. Fixed this thing in record time. 
Now for a hedgehog to boldly go where no hedgehog has gone before. Space. The Death Egg Zone. For probably the most iconic boss fights in 2D Sonic. So I learned recently that uh, this is no longer Silver Sonic and we have renamed him. Oh yeah, he jumps, that's right. How many hits? It's a lot, right? It's quite a few hits. He's gonna jump, watch, I'm gonna stand right here. Play a game of chicken. He's jumping, he's jumping, I know it. Oh, he didn't jump! There we go. I like how quickly Dr. Eggman shuts like the little window when Mecha Sonic blows up. He's like, oh shit. I remember this being a lot harder when I was younger. And now we have Dr. Eggman who can outrun Sonic. I really wanna get this toy. They just released it. I think like Jack Specific put it out. So I wish I had one ring, just like a single ring. How many hits can you take? <laughs> Look at his little belly. Ah, he got me. If you think about it, it's kind of vicious to Sega to make you do back-to-back -back boss fights with no rings. You just gotta like watch for his uh, little spiky hand. Like, why did that kill me? Why did that kill me? I, I landed a hit. All right, you know what? I'm just gonna play this really safe. I'm only gonna hit him when he drops his belly. I'm gonna keep it. I don't know how many hits it takes. It's gotta be like, I don't know, 10 maybe? Boop. Yeah, this is actually a really easy boss fight if you're just patient and not stupid like me. It, it's actually really simple. If only I did this as a kid. Did you guys see the Sonic 2 movie? I'm only asking because, you know, not gonna spoil anything in case you didn't, but I really enjoyed Sonic 2 and I'm way more excited for Sonic 3. There we go. Dismantle him. All right, we're out of here. So I can get the hell off this thing. I have absolutely no plan. I might die in the vacuum of space, but alas, Sonic made it. And all of the animals on Mobius got to watch the fireworks that night. And Tails is wondering if he's ever gonna see Sonic again. And the birds like go after him. He needs you now more than ever, Tails. Literally, cause he will die. Uh, where'd you get 50 rings, pal? I love this ending. Sonic's just chilling. And like that, Sonic 2 is done. Oh, does the death egg just casually fall to Mobius? How does it not destroy it? Sonic 3 and Knuckles. I don't remember the last time I was able to play this version of this game because what's crazy is a lot of people think that, oh, he's got his eyes on the Master Emerald. Not today, sir. It's funny because everybody thinks that uh, this is two separate games put together when in reality, they weren't able to finish Sonic 3 on time. So DLC didn't exist. So they just released a whole ass Transformer game cartridge, then you had to lock the two together. All right, we're gonna keep it going with Sonic and Tails. Sonic, for some reason, decides to hop off the tornado, turn into Super Sonic. And bam, Knuckles hits him with the left jab, collects all the emeralds, and he's out. So yeah, funny enough, this was supposed to be the definitive Sonic 3 version of the game, and uh, they just, they couldn't finish it in time for what they wanted to do. By the way, I absolutely love the bonus stages in this. I love the collect the spheres. And I had no idea in Sonic 2 you could get all of the Chaos Emeralds in Green Hill Zone. That's a wild thought to me, but uh, you've made it abundantly clear that I'm bad at video games. Just one wrong turn or one slow reflex, you hit the ping pong ball and bing, you get sent back to reality. But not today. Oh wait, hang on a second. I forgot that they used the adapted soundtrack here because they couldn't get the rights to their own game is hilarious. You know, because uh, allegedly some famous pop star may or may not have worked on the soundtrack for the original game, so they had to adapt it. I mean, it sounds a little different, but Angel Island, like, it's fine so far. It's whatever. Woo! Oh, that's it. Destroyed. Damn, they went and sent us to California. What, you thought I could only rip on New Jersey? No, 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 no. No states are safe. I gotta get out of here! All right, we breeze through the first one, which means here I'm probably gonna have a slip up. I don't know, I love Sonic 2, but Sonic and Knuckles is probably my favorite 2D Sonic game. I mean, it's Sonic 3 and Knuckles, it's a whole different animal. All right, we have 40 more to go. Where are they hiding? Once you start to go faster, the anxiety sets in. Just gotta go around here, around the bend. Two emeralds! They look like gushers in this game. Tails! I needed that! Oh, I got the fire thing now, so I think that's what we use to blast through this, right? You know, I think my entire life, I've never known how to get through there. I've kind of just accepted that. And it's gone. Come on! You stoop! Oh my god. This is top tier gameplay, ladies and gents. This is the kind of gameplay you subscribed for. Ooh, lightning. Lightning shield is good. I was right here by the boss, too. Uh, oh 
okay. And also, like, you could do this for 20 minutes. So, like, if you were playing with one of your homies and you're, like, passing off the controller, you can make them sit there while you just throw the sign around. All right, here we go. Time for Emerald number three. I say that, but how long can I keep up the streak? You just need one bad turn to throw your entire momentum off. Wow, look at this! Three emeralds in Angel Island? Oh, damn. I forgot you lose it when you go in water. But the bubble shield? Oh, is a godsend. Okay, and it's gone. Is there another bonus zone in here? There's another one, right? Oh, good. Drain all the water. Do away with all the water. I'd be, I'm okay with the drought in Angel Island. All right, this one's fun. Oh, wait, this isn't the one I'm, I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about the Gashapon machine. Oh, damn. Right, I think I'm over this. I'm gonna head out. Where are you hiding the Chaos Emeralds? I'm coming for them. Woo! Sonic hitting the gap transfer. Oh, no! I forgot about this. Oh, wait, another one! Can we keep it going? Oh, this, this is trouble. This... This is definitely trouble. The red is blending in with the, the red squares. I don't know the pattern for these. Okay, so far so good. Sometimes you just need to hit that straight away just to reset your mind. You guys getting dizzy? Because I'm definitely getting dizzy. I screwed up, it's over. I'm going too fast now. Oh my God. Oh, I can't see the red. No! Oh, we did it! <laughs> Four emeralds! I think. I'm probably best at Sonic 3. I put a lot of hours into Sonic 3 as a kid. All right, here come the bombs. Run, Tails, run! Keep running, keep running, keep running. <laughs> Stupid. What a waste of bombs. I mean, listen, the soundtrack don't sound that bad. It's not the same, but it's whatever. Can we do it without losing the shield? All right, Angel Island is cleared and we have four emeralds. Oh, here comes the boy. The introduction. He's like, ha 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 ha. Hey, you stupid. Down you go. Give me a bubble. Give me a bubble. Give me a... Oh, that was Tails that was dying. That's fine. It's funny because somebody recently asked Yuji Naka on Twitter if it was Hydro City or Hydrocity. And he was like, I don't speak English. But also Hydro City. Oh, hang on. There's a bonus stage down there. I gotta get down there. Wrong way. Wrong way. Wrong way. This was an annoying boss fight, Younger, because you gotta like... Read when he's come oh come on, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh good. Now we just do this forever. Sometimes you get an item out of it. No! Look all the bonus stages. You're hiding them from me. Like he's he's getting the emeralds too fast. We better slow him down. Maybe this way? Hello? I want the shiny rocks, please. Such a good zone, man. Hydro City is so good. Especially with these little hands that grab you and you charge up. Alright, here we go. That's what I'm looking for. Get the blue spheres. There's just a sea of red. It's the red wedding of Sonic bonus stages. That was close. I did that on purpose, though, to keep you guys on your toes. Wait, I think I know where it is. Oh, not there. No! Damn it! Oh, wait, I can retry. All right, we're going too fast now. This is not even fathomable. Here they are. All right, not bad. We got, uh, five emeralds. Only two retries. You didn't know I was kind of nice like that. You know, I got some skills in Sonic 3 with all the time I put into it. I need to make up for the way I played the rest of this game. This stupid shark taking all my rings. Stupid crab. Hello? Uh, is anyone here? Knock, knock. Oh, it's you again. Wait, can we just talk about... Yeah, this is a good boss fight. Bounce me up. Bounce me up. Yo. Oh. So Dr. Robotnik learned. He's way more tanky in Sonic 3. Maybe he just feels that way. There we go. Free the bunnies right into the water. That makes sense. All right, here we go, Marble Garden. You don't even get time to think in this one. They just catapult you. Is Marble and Marble Hill Zone the same place? So are we just like above the lava? I mean, it makes sense, right? It's a good theory. We just, we're in the nice part of Marble. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. It's just like a slightly different neighborhood. Right, we could bounce on these. <laughs> That was always fun. You know, I gotta be honest, I don't really know how people feel about Sonic 3. I don't know, I've always loved it. I don't know if it was just like newer equals better, but Sonic 3 has a special place in my heart. So much so that when I made the mistake of selling my Genesis in all my games, when I got older, the Genesis 3 came out, which was just like a mini Genesis. I remember going to Toys R Us to find it, and buying Sonic 3 along with it, and kind of just like rebuying my favorite games because I'm an idiot. Can we get the uh, the Gashapon machine? I like that one. Is it just not in Sonic and Knuckles? Like when you do Sonic and Knuckles, is it just you get this trash Sonic 1 bonus zone? All right, all right, we're going this way. Ha <laughs> ha! I gotta remember how to get hypersonic though. Getting the hyperforms is gonna be a problem. Oh, 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 oh
Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh, <laughs> I don't think I could do this. We're so close though, I have five. How oh, they turn into rings, that's right. You do like a weird pattern, they're like, uh, just save him. He's a lost cause. Oh, here's the rest, there's the rest. All right, another emerald down. Yeah, don't we have to get like the chaos emeralds and then like the super emeralds to go hyper? I honestly, I, I'm not sure. I'm gonna try, no promises. Let me focus on making it through stages alive. Ooh! Oh, I always hated those. Gotta fight this stupid little drill boy. Stupid ass boss fight. Oh, did I call this Marble Hill Zone when it's Marble Garden? You know what I meant. All right, place is caving in. We gotta get out of here. I love this Sonic sprite because he looks like he's got some attitude. All right, I, st I still have no idea how to control this one. You no, know, it's been over two decades. What's this way? Oh, ho, ho, ho! wait, is it finally time? Collect the blue spheres. The, see, the trick is, you see, there's there's actually no blue spheres. They trap you. They have you running around for eternity looking for them. They don't exist. See, if you don't find them fast enough, you just start going faster and faster and faster. And we got it! That's seven Chaos Emeralds. And for me, that's pretty damn early. All right, so Sonic has all seven Chaos Emeralds now. But can he see why kids love Cinnamon Toast Crunch? All right, it's time. See, I, now I know you gotta hit the button. The Super Sonic button. Yeah, I, I see why the soundtrack is kind of weird. Oh, so fast and hard to control. Oh, I'm gonna rip that boss a new one, though. Watch this. Good, come down here. <laughs> I can just stand there and it kills him. All right, this is a good boss fight. Cause you're being held by tails. Just walk into him. Hey, I lost my super form, that's not cool. I still got 20 rings. Don't take it away from me, I earned that. Oh hell yeah, carnival night time. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Wow, look at this. It's not nice out here popping balloons on free balloon day. I think I love this stage more than Casino Night Zone. It's got a little more life to it. I mean, Casino Night Zone has a special place in my heart, but... Oh, hang on one second. Content. Out here going stupid, going crazy. Just give me the rings. Oh my God, I am speed. Oh, this is hilarious. This is a good boss fight too, because you kind of have to like, you get a platform on the little thing. Let me die, please. <gasps> I was super Sonic. I was super goddamn Sonic. Oh, I gotta do it like a peasant now. Oh, the colors are different. Did, did I? Oh, there we go. Did I break it? I'm just gonna iframe this thing. Poor Tails just keeps dying. Loki, uh, kind of upset about losing Super Sonic. Shouldn't have died there. That's all I'm saying. Okay, yeah, the uh, the music is weird. It's strange. It's getting stranger. Stupid spike ball. Stop. Stop! All right, let's go this way. Don't smush me. Don't. Wait, I could just like ran up and punch Knuckles in his face. Oh, turn the lights off. Okay, and now just continue the weird music. Hang on, I need some air. Is there air nearby? Thank you. If I go supersonic, can I not drown? I don't know that. <gasps> you know what? I'm not even gonna try it. I saw that happening. I'm not doing it. So for comparison, I went back and listened to the actual soundtrack uh, from Sonic 3, and uh, what a downgrade. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, I think that was the same spot. I swear, the more I listen to the soundtrack, I, I think it's driving me mad. I, I think I'm going insane. At least there's no clowns though. Man, that would be awful. Speaking of clowns, I've actually never played Nights into Dreams. I never got a, a Sega Saturn when I was a kid. Like I wanted it, but then I realized that a lot of games kind of didn't come out for it. And uh, then Sega, you know, you know what happened. I'm gonna go real slow this time. I swear, fear and loathing in Carnival Night Zone. Mostly the loathing. That is a crazy movie if you just want anxiety for about an hour and a half. That are uncut gems. The lights are back on, and I'm super! This is it, this is the part right here. The longest time it was like, what do you do? You have to, you know, just hit up and down. I guess Sonic runs on the walls. Candy canes we go, come on! God damn, at least I got a checkpoint that time. I swear, these things are so punishing. 
got the longest zones in history, and we missed that. Could have got Super Sonic again, but it's not like it matters because I die anyway. Wow, Sonic's too fast for this game. Where is he? Where is he? Hello. How you doing? By the way, I never formally introduced myself. My name is Sonic the Hedge. Okay. Three rings away, too. That's okay. We have the double jump, so we had the double jump. At least the boss theme still slaps. Iframes. Iframes. A lot of uh, Robotnik's mechs weapons have giant balls. What are you trying to say, Doc? Oh my god. Nothing is a bigger travesty than this Ice Cap Zone track. Ice Cap Zone is probably my favorite track in the game, but this is horrible. It feels like I'm playing a game on, like, one of those leapfrog devices. Okay, excuse me. It's not like it matters. You can get crushed by many things in Sonic 3. I remember this boss. Snowman guy. Good. We killed him before, like, one ring left. What's the point of that? Excuse me. Quick transformation come through. Man, what crappy construction. Like, press this button here to destroy the bridge so you can go down. We have to rebuild it every time. It's not exactly cost effective. I'm getting those just because. Just because I can. See, this is what the barrel should have been. The jumping up and down mechanic. We're just, just launching. We're going to space. All right, I think Ice Cap Zone was honestly probably one of the fastest zones for us to come out here. I don't like that we immediately lose super form. Launch base zone. Turns out underneath all that snow was a Death Egg rebuild construction zone. Who would have thought? Honestly, another great zone. Launch base is great. It's overall really fun. Uh-oh. Oh, oh, oh the safety mechanisms failed. I have the speed shoe. Can I get the speed shoe and supersonic? I want to see what that feels like. Oh, wow. Does it stack or am I just... Am I seeing things? I don't think it stacks. There's no way. I find it hilarious that supersonic can fly, but he needs to take, like, the little zip line. All right, I'm vulnerable. i get my form back. Hey, you bring that one individual block back here. What are you planning to do with that? Uh-oh. There goes the whole tower. That's why we can't have nice things. Nice, Tail. Look at Tail's getting some shots in. I taught you well. See, that's what I was looking for. Free stuff. A lot of water in Sonic 3. They were designed in the third game. They are like, what do the fans want? Yuji Naka was like, they love water. Put more of it. This is peak Sonic level design. This is it. Loop de loops, going fast. Maybe not. Maybe not boss design though. I'm just gonna stand here. Strategy. All right, just just keep throwing the bosses at me. That's fine. A lot of phases here. Just I gotta gotta do it before I run out of time. Unfortunately, I don't think that's gonna happen. Oh crap. Oh no. Uh, might be screwed here. Ah! <laughs> he poked me. Oh, now I gotta do this the peasant's way. I'm supersonic. I'm too good for this. Why did the weather change? All I did was take out a different robot. I like when you hit him, he's like, oh, damn it. I gotta get out of here. It's actually uh, kind of easy. Kind of sad that I died. So they uh, they released a new trailer at Gamescom today for Sonic Frontiers. And I said I wasn't going to do any more videos kind of reacting to stuff. So I guess this is, this is probably the best forum to talk about it. What I think. But uh, there was a lot of cool stuff showed off in the new trailer. And we finally got a look at the plot of the game. I'm cautiously excited. Uh, I'm going to fall on my death, aren't I? That thing shouldn't be on fire. Oh, it's okay. We're just going to peacefully float down, as giant hunks of metal often do. Bye. Should we wave? All right. It has fallen. Now we begin some of my favorite stages, the Sonic and Knuckles portion. The coast is clear. Press this button. Close the door. It's where I keep all my snacks. Oh. All right. Chaos Emeralds. We have to return them. Damn. What did I, oh, that's right. Now we gotta get the super emeralds. Oh, yeah, okay. The yellow ones, they make you bounce. The yellow ones will make you bounce and the bands will make her dance. All right, super emerald number one. It's so big. I think there was somebody in the comment section that threatened me with bodily harm if I didn't get the hyper form in this game. So, you know I'm gonna do it. Please don't hurt me. God, I love Mushroom Hill Zone. Such a fun stage. Boing. Some of the tracks sound closer to the actual thing, and some are just, like, not even close. Is it only certain tracks that uh, they were having some issues with? Like, I want to know the full gamut of the situation. Also a good boss fight, the random, like, lumberjack robot. Now he's dead. He's like, D it's not working! 
Press it again! See, unfortunately, I don't really know where a lot of the bonus stages are. I know there's, there's multiple in each stage. I'm gonna try and find them. I feel like they were much easier to come by in uh, the Sonic 3 portion, I say, as I just leap into another one. That was a bad run. Oh, f I accidentally hit- No! <laughs> I accidentally said no! Uh, I would've had two emeralds! All right, let's try this again. A lot of yellow ones here. Oh, crap. This one's gonna take a while. If Chuck has 102 coins, and each retry is one coin, how many retries did it take if he's left with 86 coins? All right, this one was a huge pain in the ass. We got another Super Emerald. Whew. Could have had three now, but I'm dumb. Huh, that shouldn't be there. Pretty sure satellites don't emit electricity like that. Oh, this is a good boss fight. Having to run and dodge some of the, the spike balls. I like how they flash too. Like, why is that happening? Are the spike balls just like hive mind? They're like, ow, we feel master's pain. Eggman's got a lot of ships in this game. Ooh, banger track. No, Tails, come on, yawning. You have no taste. I'm just, I'm getting kind of worried that I'm not going to get all the super emeralds in time. If I don't, I'm gonna be really sad. I don't know if I know where the uh, the bonus stages are here. I think we're coming up on one, so let me be vigilant. That was it, I, I missed it. Super emeralds be damned. I need ya. <laughs> Why the f did I do that? Not my fattest brain move to date. I don't know, something in my brain was like, hey, there's probably a bonus stage under there. What do you know, there wasn't. This part of Flying Battery, it's, it's very Mega Man X. Like big Spark Man drill vibes. Here we go, this is what I'm talking about. Let's get these emeralds. Oh, here we go again. All right, this one's only 37. Oh, wait, is this the one from last time? Oh, crap. How am I supposed to do this? My brain can't process it. Huh? All right, so I've solved it. What you do is that, and then they all turn into rings. They don't tell you that. Maybe not there. They make it look much harder. But then they they fake you out. They're like, all right, we're gonna, we're gonna turn them all into rings. Watch this, it's magic. Who knew Sonic was a magician? And for my next trick, I'm gonna produce a good game. All right, six left. Where are they? One, two, oh, three, four, five. Hey, we did it. That was much easier than I thought it was gonna be. All right, now I'm ready to fight a boss. No boss? Oh, okay, That that's right. This one jukes you out. It is the boss, okay? Ow, bet you can't hit me. Why are you hitting yourself? Why are you hitting yourself? Why, ow, why are you hitting yourself? Dr. Eggman's worst designed robot yet. Yep, one, jumping on like the air vents, I guess. Get these things cleaned out every once in a while. I could be wrong, but I feel like out of all the 2D Sonic games, Sonic and Knuckles is the fastest. This place is infested with mice. You know Dr. Eggman has the money for an exterminator. Or something more humane. What, they're robots, you say? Yeah, I know. Boss fight time. This whole thing? Uh, how do I, how do I reach him? How do I reach him? How do I, how do I reach him? Tails, Tails, help me out here. Oh, there we go. Just kidding, I, I knew, uh, I knew that was gonna happen. Dr. Eggman, throw that thing in a circle. All right, let's finish him off. The little Eggmobile is, uh, it's pretty versatile. You'd be surprised how many robots it's built into. That's like his Nintendo Switch and Switch dock. Sandopolis! Um, can I get some help here? I think my brain completely forgot about Sandopolis. I mean, I'm starting to remember it now, but in retrospect, when I was thinking about all the zones that I have to be playing through again, I forgot about this one. Oh, there is another one. All right, which one are we doing next? We got these three, so we gotta get four more. Wait, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Hang on, I, I gotta restart. Oh my God, it's gone. Oh, it's gone. Oh, this is hard. Oh, it's the sandworm. Oh, this is this is horrible. You guys are gonna bully me. Why do I have the chance to just up and leave like that? It should be like, hey, are you sure you want to be a dumbass? Just allow me to opt in. I like how they just decided to have like Sonic rappelling down the side of a building. Like this is the opening cutscene in Call of Duty. My goodness, that's a lot of sand. Oh, here comes the pyramid. We didn't do anything to trigger. We just showed up. Very grand entrance for this golem. How do we hit him again? I don't know if that's right. I feel like there's something else that has to be done. We have to knock him into the sand? I honestly, I don't remember. Like I said, I blocked this entire uh, zone out from my memory. Oh uh, yeah, okay, that was right. Gamer instincts always prevail. All right, into the strange pyramid we go, without questions. Someone turn the lights on. Why is there electricity in the pyramid? That's right, there's ghosts in this one. I 
remember now. You gotta, you gotta keep the ghost away with the light. It's coming after me. Yo, he's low key kind of terrifying though. Oh god. I just like how wildly different ghosts are from game to game. It's like these ghosts don't like to be looked at. These ghosts hate the daylight. Yo, is there, is there a light? Like real quick, real quick, real quick, please, please, please. No, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh, they have horns. Why are they not attacking me yet? It's coming though, right? Yep, here, here they go. This shit is a Metroidvania, and I can't remember what I have to do. Oh, I can kill them. Ghosts also hate physical altercations. All right, I need to just stay put here. I gotta go this way. Why do I think they were gonna be more menacing than they actually are? I don't know why that took me like eight tries. Goodbye, ghosts. It was nice knowing you. Why is everything in this game that gives you anxiety on a timer? Drowning, the ghosts. Whoa! Oh! Okay, really cutting it close now. Maybe this way? Oh, that was not worth it. That was not worth it. Something tells me that using Tails, like if you're doing a Sonic and Tails run, might be some kind of speedrun strat. You go significantly faster when he's holding you. And if anyone out there knows, feel free to let me know. I just want to know if my big brain is right. My god, how long is this zone? Nine and a half minutes. One stage in Sonic Force is like a minute and a half. They snapped with this one. They were like, all right, stand up. Let's make it a whole ass game. Ow. Oh, he's got a hyper beam. That's right. Gotta hit the, the gem on the top. Jump in the hands. Nope. Oh, wait, how'd you get down here? Yeah, we just like blow his entire forehead away. There we go. Sometimes you gotta find that rhythm. All right, lava reef zone. Or like lava rock zone. Looks man-made to me. This is definitely man-made. I mean, hell, there's pipes down here. Oh, come on. They didn't tell me there was gonna be a lava log plume in the brochure. Oh, this guy's back. This is what you've been up to. It was my shield. Oh, wait. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, I'm not gonna mess up this time. Love it when they turn into rings. It's like Sonic's looking out for me. I want you guys to know there's a mosquito down here right now where I'm recording, and uh, it's really messing with me. He's like buzzing around me, and I'm, I'm, I'm trying to I'm trying to kill him. But at the same time, these super emeralds are not gonna collect themselves. Oh, wait. Is there another one here? No, it can't be, right? It can't. Yeah. Then, oh, wait. Wait. Talk about making up for lost time. 150? There's no way. I'm gonna get launched, like, right into the... Yep, I gotta figure out the pattern. I have a feeling it's, like, right after I collect the last one, I need to turn immediately. Alright, I think I got this figured out. It's just the pattern of, like, just going straight, really. But it's going so fast now that... Okay, alright. Whoa, I did it! <laughs> when you figure out the pattern, it's actually kind of fun. <sighs> okay, we got two more to go. We still got plenty of zones, so there'll be uh, be quite a bit of hypersonic. Like I gotta say, they threw me a bone with that one. They saw what was happening in some of the uh, the earlier zones. No, no way. At no way. How do I get down there? Okay, wait, hang on. No, I didn't want to go in there. Oh, wait, this is the one I was talking about. Why'd it take so long to get one of these? Oh, I, I saw it. I saw, I know it's here. That's right, fireballs can't hurt me if I have the fire shield. Oh, wait, hang on, Tails. You help me out here. Help me out. Come on. Come on. <laughs> I don't like the looks of this one. They're all scattered. I mean, it's kind of less stressful, though, because there's, like, no crazy jumps that I have to do. 11 to go. One. Wow, okay, first try. I wonder what the difficulty order is, if there is one. But with that, there's only one Super Emerald to go, and then it's hyper time. I swear, if we find another bonus stage here, I'm gonna lose it. All right, boss fight time. You have to fight not one, but two wacky inflatable robot arms. Oh, crap, out of rings. Yeah, that's done. I got the big hand thing. How's Tails still getting hit? All right, we just gotta find one more Super Emerald, and the rest of the game is cake. Like I said, all right, we are 47 orbs away from just like straight up bitch slapping everything Eggman's gonna throw at us. I think the thought of this is hilarious. It's like, well, do you want these life altering gems? Well, you're gonna have to complete a series of mini games. <laughs> oh, there it is. Am I getting a sugar rush right now? Cause I'm feeling pretty hyper. We have 33 rings, we need 50, right? We have nine rings. We need 50, right? All right, I'm gonna be completely honest here. Aside from a, a color change and maybe speed, I don't know what Hypersonic can do that Supersonic can't. Just know he's more powerful. He 
because I read the hell out of my Supersonic vs. Hyper Knuckles Archie comic. So much so that the spine was falling apart. That was easily my favorite comic. 25 rings. They do not want you to collect any rings here. They don't want... <laughs> Watch this! Oh, wait. What the... I don't remember this. Do I just have a screen-clearing attack? It looks like I have a double jump, too. Maybe that's what that is? Ah, interesting. Collected all those emeralds only to just drop dead. It's like, hey, Chalk, why don't you just be more careful? Why don't you, why don't you shut up? How about that? Ow, ow, ow! Where are you sending me? Uh, what? Did you just time travel? Can I earn 50 rings here? God help you if I do. Oh, crap. I didn't know that was going to happen. This is an epic boss fight, though, for boss sequence. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Because I can I can touch all this now. I don't have to stay on the, uh, on the platform. So what am I trying to do here? I'm trying to get it the... Yeah, the spike balls have to hit him. I just need to dodge. You should have never put this here. This is a broken strat. I don't know why I'm trying to platform. I can just, like, chill. A lot of these bosses are self-sabotage. You just gotta wait for them to hit themselves. You know, for a, a mad genius, Dr. Eggman is, uh, he's not very bright. Just standing there, taking it on the chin. All right, come on, Tails, we're busting out of here. It's time for Hidden Palace Zone, which I missed in Sonic 2, and I apologize for that. I know you guys wanted to see me get to Hidden Palace Zone, and I just completely forgot they re-added it for Sonic 2 and Origins. Beam me up, Eggman. Okay, I got 40 rings. I'm waiting for something to take away my last 10. Oh, Knuckles, it's time to fight, huh? Boop! Boop! Okay, come on, fly at me. It's like those dudes that go to the gym and shadow box in the mirror. Oh no, we killed him. Yep, you see all these? Yeah, I, I collected them for you. Right, now you realize, Knuckles. Now you realize. I'll help you. Come on, we'll get him. We'll get him together. Oh, that's what Knuckles skeleton looks like. <laughs> he just shocks him. Come on, pal. Come on, get up. Come on, we're homies now. Man, he is not in great shape, Knuckles. So, funny enough, I went to the store today and, um... I don't know, the cashier was being really annoying. I was wearing a Sonic shirt. And she goes, oh, I love Sonic. Remember Knuckles? And I went, no. And that's the whole story. Come on, ten rings, please. Please, come on! Sky Sanctuary Zone is like the zone to go hypersonic. Could have been hypersonic here. Fighting Mecha Sonic Mark II, or whatever the hell we call him now. Sonic 3 and Knuckles is very cinematic. There's like a lot of cool things that happens in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. Nine rings. Come on. He's gonna take him from me, isn't he? Yep, bastard. You know what the messed up part is? Like, we're getting close to the end of the game, and I'm just not gonna have him. I just wanna zoom through. I'm going in here to see if I get some rings. Like, I'm desperate now. Come on, one more. There we go. All right, take me away. All right, it's time. Unlimited power! <laughs> you dumb idiot. <laughs> you thought! You didn't know Hypersonic was gonna pull up? I, uh... Killed the mosquito, by the way. He won't be bothering anyone ever again. So this is the game they wanted to release. And obviously they didn't because they split it up into, into two games. But can you imagine like if this came out? Like we went from Sonic 2 to Sonic 3 and Knuckles in one shot. I gotta say, Dr. Eggman really made some, uh, some significant upgrades in the Death Egg. This is significantly nicer than the last one. I just wanna be hypersonic, I earned it. I mean, if nothing at all, I did get to destroy uh, Mecha Sonic. Oh, hang on. I see some. Yep. 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 Come to me. No. Don't take it away. Don't. Don't. <laughs> I, 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 uh, uh, I, I have no rings. I, I have no rings. I should have just came down here, man. This is what I should have did. I'm on such a power trip right now. And the funny part is Tails is just hanging out with me. And he's keeping up. It makes you wonder, like, why did Super Sonic think he could uh, take Hyper Knuckles in the comics? You see, you should have designed this like Sonic 2. In Death Egg Zone, you couldn't get 50 rings. So if you had all the Chaos Emeralds, it's not like it mattered. And it's gone. All right, here we go. Doomsday Zone. You like how the sign just, like, stays there? Oh, sorry. Death Egg Act 2. Got there are two acts here. Oh! Ah, <laughs> uh, you guys didn't learn. Stop putting so many rings in the Death Egg. Man, Hypersonic is evil looking. I am afraid that I'm... What the f*** just happened? All right, we're gonna stay away from the pointy things. You hear that, Hypersonic? 
We don't want you to get a boo-boo now. See, these things, they were very expensive to install, but Eggman spared no expense. This way, I need some more rings. I'm running out of rings. All right, I'm out. Can we find more, though? I'm doing something wrong here. Oh, I see. I remember. There we go. I, I'm just gonna, like, spend the rest of the, the boss fight in, like, this two-foot radius. It's like, why would I ever have to do anything else? Look at Eggman just bopping over there. He's like, hmm, 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 hmm. Gonna kill Sonic. <laughs> or are you? Are you? He's so fast, though. All right, time for Doomsday Zone. Yeah, gotta hit his little fingies. I gotta break his little fingies. What, what is Sonic in the mob? Yeah, I don't know, uh, cops. His fingers were broken before I caught him. Eggman's like, come here, Sonic, smell my finger. Hey, dude, blow your nose. You got something coming out of it. Oh, crap. Ah, oh, damn it. Got me. Can you duck this? I can. Okay, so that, that seems to be what we gotta do here. Ah! Ah! All right, I got the pattern figured out. Just got, gotta not be too greedy here. Jump over this. Oh, we got him. That wasn't that many hits. I thought it was gonna be way more hits. I was preparing for a long battle. Uh, oh, we still got the Master Emeralds. We gotta like, we gotta like bop him. Get, get back here, give that back. That's Knuckles. Well, it's not his, but he, he protects it. He's the guardian of the Emerald. <gasps> Don't fall off, please. Oh, we got him. The Emerald is safe, but we're not. Doomsday Zone, and we are hypersonic. How many rings do we gotta collect? Yep, we're, we're doing just fine. Everything's fine here. All right, we made it. Get back here, you coward. Yeah, we gotta knock the missiles into him. So the only thing is uh, time is an issue here. But this is a pretty easy boss fight. We just go in circles, missiles will do their thing. Then the missiles, thank you. The missiles will do their thing. How many enemies in this game do we just have to make them hit themselves? That, that's gotta be it, right? We have eight seconds. Four, three, two. I'm gonna fall on my death, aren't I? Yep. And the music for Doomsday Zone is intense. Come on, put the emerald down. It's not yours. Is your name on it? We're almost there. The journey's coming to an end. I know, Dr. Eggman, you don't wanna say goodbye. Neither do I. I had fun with you too. All right, we got the Master Emerald. We're off. Uh, okay. It just so happens we have one of those. Tails is like, don't worry, I got the Master Emerald hitch. We're fine. Here we go, back to Angel Island. Now with the Master Emerald back, we can float once again. Although it was nice kind of, you know, being in the water. We had beaches for a little while. Oh, so that's where you put it. Knuckles is like, thanks. How am I going to move this thing now? And so wraps Sonic Origins. All the classic Sonic games that I grew up with. Oh, he's got a little, look at his little floaty. He's like, hey, get off that. You're going to pop it. Good, he, he should. Do it, please don't. I can't swim. <laughs> and that's it. We'll see you next time.